He will keep you to sin until Jesus Christ come and then you're going to be doomed. Friends, God, his creation power. Genesis when God said, let there be light. And there was light. So when God said be, means his creation power. You can be holy by the grace of God. This is the old gospel. And now the devil's using, a, you know, hypnosis pastors. You know, all they want is, you know, money. Riding Mercedes and all kinds of expensive vehicles. They fail to be a Bible Christian. Christ is calling a humble instrument. If you are failed to be a Bible Christian, be converted. It's time to take a stand. Forget yourself. Don't look for what's in it for you. It's time to look for what's in it for God. That's how apostles and disciples, they live. In the first century, Jesus Christ is coming for the remnant church. Miss left over. Our character, our life star is going to be like the first century, the church that Jesus Christ set up. Christ is coming. Believe that you're going to be holy. He's going to help you. It depends how you program yourself. If you are watching a Jesuit, Hollywood, worldly program, so-called television program, then the devil's going to use those pagans or infidels to preach you and you're going to be in darkness until Jesus Christ can order the great controversy. Notice the book, The Great Controversy, because it's preparation. It will prepare you by the grace of God. Friends, whenever they enforce their son worship Day, Sunday worship. Whenever the law is in force in your country, do not accept it. The mark of the beast in their forehead. Symbolic in Revelation, your forehead means your decision. And also when Revelation says their right hand means your action will follow your decision once you accept their son worship day. When it's in force, Sunday worship. Friends, Take a stand. Christ is coming. He loved you so much so that when he was on the cross, Jesus Christ says, I thirst. So whenever you're in temptation, remember when he says, I thirst because of you and I.